I have an apology that I want to read here because Steve Myers, big salute to him. He brought up um, something also even with the, um, some of the clout chasing that's been going on out here. Issue that, um, or not a non-issue when it comes to a rapper out here who was dissing me, okay? I'm not really here to try to give her any more energy but there was one thing, and I did mention this a couple of times when um, when I was talking to y'all before. There was one thing about this that was getting under my skin, and it was the Alize line. Okay, I didn't like when I don't like when rappers just make up shit just because it sounds hot. Okay. One second here. Okay. I don't like when rappers make now, up shit just because it sounds hot. To hear important instructions. Because to when the shit don't be true, Your it could be very detrimental. To start in 30 seconds. It could be very detrimental to people's businesses moving on in the future. So when she said that little line about um, you told Alize that she had to fuck to advance, that actually had me a little hot. Because all the rest of those little whack ass bars, I don't care about, you know what I'm saying? Even if you're Your saying some, will go live in five seconds. even if you're Four, saying some true shit, three, two, one, it won't piss me off. Sorry. All right, phone lines are back open now. Yeah, even if you say some like some true shit about me that might be embarrassing. As long as it's true, it won't piss me off. Young um, Tenders, you sent your, your, your track. I won't be able to play it here because it's YouTube, but I'll definitely, definitely go into the emails. I'll give it a post on the uh, Instagram stories. Okay, I got you. I'll post you on my Percy. One time. Thank you for the donation. Y'all, if y'all want to follow suit and get some, some story posts tonight, let's get it popping. And the phone lines are back open. Um, let's talk about that. Respect to you, young um, trendsetter. So listen, I have here in my Instagram stories, I just posted it now. I'll probably take it down because I already posted it before. And I don't, it's not really a thing anymore. But I have the apology because that's the one thing that fucking got under my skin. I was like, where did that happen, shorty? When and where did that happen? Because at one point in time, she wanted to be on the network, the We Love Hip Hop Network, Nessia that is. And I was like, sure. We have a show called Zaylink that we just started not too long ago. Why don't you pull up on that show? There will be a lady who will be able to interview you and y'all will have a nice woman on woman conversation, maybe get some different things. And this is not, I didn't say all of that, but this is what I had in my mind by trying to set up the interview where Alize does the interview. Okay. Cause don't get it twisted. Alize booked a lot of her own interviews, but I too help the team book interviews. All right. It's not a thing. If I can get at them quicker on my DMS, or using the fucking We Love Hip Hop um, DMs, that's a soft thing. You know what I'm saying? You want them on the show? I'll DM them ASAP. Dr. Umar um, Johnson, Orange Juice Jug. Thank you for the donation. It says, file a def defamation lawsuit on Nessia. Holy. Bro. <laughs> Don't put ideas in my head. <laughs> Thank you for the donation, family. Um, let's see here. I just posted this. I reposted this. Bing! Shit. One second. Let me move me from the screen so that we can see this. 
Drop a like. Drop a like. I'll put me over here under the chat. And let's go back. Let's take a second go back. Uh, da, 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 da. Yo, make sure to tap into that Troy Man interview, yo. Stop playing, man. That's available on our channel right now. He's one of the finalists from Rhythm and Flow Netflix special. You know what I'm saying? Um, BET Wild Out Wednesday award winner. The man's accomplished, bro. He has a whole album with Take Heat. And y'all niggas ain't tapping in. Interview's fire. Suits of 416 Downey. I see you, bro. See? Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Toronto Police Emergency Task Force take down the GGGs. Right? 1,900 at the time. It's past that now. Troy Man, 107. Y'all hypocrites. All right, let's get to the apology. So, she was responding to somebody in the comments, a guy named Jay Cooks. Who's Jay Cooks? You know what I'm saying? And Jay Cooks was like, what about the Alice A line? Ha, 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 Friday, you perv. <laughs> so, Alice A jumps in, and I haven't spoken to this girl in mad long. Okay? Since the time that, you know, I let her go from the network, I haven't spoken to her. I have already cleared this up over a year ago, laugh out loud. Nothing intimate ever happened between me and him. We had created differences. It really, um, it's really all the people on the outside speculating about how things looked and appeared. It was just a name drop in a song. She was, she conceptualized and she's talented. I was supposed to interview her back then, but it didn't happen. That's, um, that was cool. It's no different from any other situation, true or not, in the industry. I couldn't be more clear in my YouTube video explanation about the total version of what went down. It's like everyone wants me to keep explaining. Y'all want me and him to have to clear the air, um, clear the air episode, or you want us to have a clear the air episode, my bad, or something, hashtag after Zaylink. That's the name of your show, after Zaylink, fam? Um, I'm really past this. Moved on long time. Where you hear that at, Shorty? Enjoy the little clout that you got, the little views you got. Basura ass trap. Don't worry about the twenty percent, um, um, Doctor Umar. I already got more than twenty percent. We made more money off the tune and off her little temper tantrum than she did. If you use ether, like I said, you Ron browse and them that niggas get paid for the beat. You got to pay six buzz unless they gave you a freebie to post on their YouTube channel. Okay. So when I take a clip of your old interview and repost that. And that monetizes and you keep on running up the search engine with your name. Guess what? Your interview pops up next. When you jump on Instagram live and you go, wee, 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 wee. And I'm there, SSK, the screenshot king, doing other shit and recording you, getting ready to post you back up on YouTube, monetized, we still make money. At that point, we passed the 20%. And then when I sit up here and, oh my God, he gave me a whole two hours. No, I gave you an hour, which was a little bit too fucking long. You right. When I give you an hour and then talk about three other subjects and then chop them into other pieces and they're all monetized pieces and an hour of it is talking about you made money again.
So who won that beef? Because it's not, I'm not keeping the money for myself. The whole team eat. Everybody eat. Everybody eat B. Everybody eat B. You talk shit, Gutsy Guts eats. You talk shit, Gucci eats. Talk more. We want to run it up. Niggas need new microphones. You know what I'm saying? Some other sound equipment. So every time you talk, it's like it's like the Dre Day time. Remember when when Easy and Dre were going at each other? Y'all, y'all too young for that. I'm sorry. The nigga Easy say, Dre Day. Every Dre Day is Easy's payday. You understand? Every time you speak, we run it up. You set up a microphone, you start talking on Instagram Live, we run it up. Holy. It's crazy. <laughs> Anyhow, what's next? There was something I wanted to talk about here with the, uh, there was a couple of things here. And salute to Alizé for clearing that up too, you know what I'm saying? She didn't have to do that. She could have just left that shit in the air. People just wondering, ooh, hoo, 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 Friday, you fucking parent, but ain't nobody gonna do a work for We Love Hip Hop. No, fam, I take that shit serious. I don't want to have it just a staff or demand them. There's women who work for the staff, fam. We don't play them type of games around here. Don't ever disrespect the man them. <laughs> 